in this lesson let's explore about what happens when a item or library or any sharepoint resource is deleted and how to restore those resources like list or sharepoint document library okay now i will explain through two users one user is having full owner permissions and one user is having normal permissions like a uh, user uh, with uh, edit permissions okay so whenever you delete an option uh, a list or any document library normally what happens in our desktop it will go to recycle bin just like that there will be a recycle bin in microsoft sharepoint okay so whenever you re uh, delete or uh, delete a list item or document library those the item will be go into uh, recycle bin any user can uh, delete item with if he is having those permissions and uh, that item will be go into recycle bin and again he can restore that from the recycle bin okay let's see this and also whenever he uh, deletes an item uh, it will take 93 days uh, it will keep the item uh, deleted item in the recycle bin in for 93 days okay so after this 93 days uh, this will be permanently deleted and uh, if the user deletes the item in recycle bin uh, it will go to second stage recycle bin where the permission will be having with uh, site collection admin okay from that second stage recycle bin he can uh, again the admin can recover this uh, deleted item okay so now let's see uh, we, we can in the action let's see in the action how it will work go to a list this is uh, go to a, this is a user this is a normal user who is having uh, edit permissions so here go to one list go to site contents and you can see here one list university student info okay i will go here and i will delete one item in the list I am deleting one item here. Okay, delete. So after deleting this item, if you want to again restore this item, go to site contents. And here you can see the recycle bin. Okay, here you can see the recycle bin here. you can see the recycle bin click that recycle bin and also it is showing how many deleted items are there in the recycle bin click this recycle bin and now you can see the deleted item here okay so select that item so if you are not doing anything it will keep that item for 93 days in sharepoint online okay and you can restore it once you re it's restored you can go to the same list again go to the same list and you can notice that item has been recovered see now the item came again okay like this uh, a user can restore items from a recycle bin okay now we will delete from the recycle bin itself okay so whenever you de delete from the recycle bin say suppose when you deleted a first item in the list okay now so it will it will go to re recycle bin and it will uh, the, it will be there up to until 93 days okay so suppose uh, some 60 days passed 
and you delete uh, from the uh, recycle bin so what it will go to the second stage recycle bin and uh, there the remain remaining days it will stay there so if, if it is uh, 60 days remaining days are 60 days the 60 days it will remain there okay so the important point here is there are two recycle bins here one is first stage recycle bin for user and the second stage recycle bin is for the uh, SharePoint administrator and the items which are deleted will be there in the recycle bin until up to 93 days only okay so let's see we will delete one item here now with a normal user and uh, from now go to recycle bin now go to recycle bin and the right recycle bin and from recycle bin also we will delete this item delete and uh, since it is deleted from the first stage recycle bin we will go to the second stage recycle bin in the uh, owner with owner permissions okay now this account is having owner permissions now and uh, let's go to the site contents and here go to sites site settings and here we can notice if anything available site collection recycle bin something if available but uh, control f recycle bin is available here under site collection administration click here now you can notice nothing here why so in the bottom if you notice there is sec check the second stage recycle bin okay this will become the first stage recycle bin for any user and if you want to go to second stage recycle bin only admin will be having the permissions here just click the in the bottom in the bottom footer we got here second stage recycle bin okay you carefully observe here click this second stage recycle bin in the bottom and you can see the deleted item by the user from the recycle bin now as a admin you can restore this item from the second stage recycle bin okay restore and once it is restored let's go and see that item restored or not with normal user permission go to home and go to that particular site contents and go to the list where we have deleted the item yes if you observe here this item again restored from the second stage recycle bin this is the procedure how you can uh, restore any deleted item in a SharePoint from the recycle bin a normal user can uh, restore if uh, it is deleted from the uh, recycle bin first stage recycle bin it can be re record from the second stage recycle bin with the uh, owner SharePoint admin access okay thank you for watching this lesson